I look over and my roommate is on the phone with a tattoo shop. <laughs> Am I really gonna do this right now? <laughs> when I was a kid, I never really thought I'd get a tattoo or do anything that kind of crazy. My friends called me caution freak when I was growing up because I wouldn't like skateboard or do anything. I was a kid with the camera filming them doing everything. The craziest thing I've ever seen Brian do is he bought a car after thinking about it for eight months. He's very responsible. He's the one that takes the check to our landlord, you know, texting me at 10 o'clock at night like, hey, are you going to be home tonight? Being from Colorado, I'm a big Denver Broncos fan, and this year they made it to the Super Bowl. Brian was super pumped. Oh, I'm sorry, the Broncos are winning 10 to 0. Cam's got nothing right now. I'm, I'm starting to get, like, just kind of really amped up about the game. Let's go! Every time Denver does something great, I'm like cheering, getting into people's faces, being kind of annoying. Yeah! So I kind of started making these bets, saying like, if Peyton Manning throws a pick, you gotta take your shirt off. Yeah! There he is! Then I yelled, do the worm! Like right after the Broncos scored a touchdown, and... Hey! I actually didn't really even know that I could do the worm. We were like, buy us pizza! And he was like, I'll buy three large pizzas for everyone to have. Let's go Broncos! We were like, jump in a pool! And he was like, Bronco! Bronco! Yeah! And then we were just like, you know what, the Broncos win. Are you gonna get a Super Bowl tattoo? You gotta get a Super Bowl tattoo. And I was like, yeah, sure. And then I look over and my roommate is on the phone with a tattoo shop. And I'm like, hmm, am I really gonna do this right now? Let's go! Super Bowl champion, baby! Yeah! I didn't get the tattoo for like my friends to appease them and for everyone to cheer me on. It was really fun to just go for something and do it and like in the moment just be like this is this is going to happen no matter what. And like in all like honesty it kind of like started making me think like Brian just got a tattoo and he just went for it and it is like cliche as it might sound it started making me think like what are things that I should just be kind of like going for and like starting to just do with my life. Sometimes people are too afraid to take a risk whether it be a really big thing or a small thing like getting a Super Bowl tattoo, I think it's important. I think the best part about getting a tattoo is it's a conversation. People ask questions about it, like what does it mean? As simple as, oh, this is when the Broncos run the Super Bowl, Super Bowl 50, or it's something deeper, it has like this meaning, but it's a conversation, it's something that relates to you, and it's like, it's a memory. My name is Brian and I got a Super Bowl tattoo. Thank <laughs> you.